video for the second time and today or in this video I'm wearing hot pink. Previously I was wearing light pink and today I thought of wearing hot pink. Look at my nails, look at my lipstick, everything is hot pink right now. Anyways, okay, actually today I'm going to talk about Facebook. I know you might say, okay, people talked about it over and over again. So it's like really, 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 really consumed on YouTube. But I felt like adding my own touch to this topic and add my perspective on this. So I would still talk about it because it still annoys me. Some of the things that I will say in this video might you might have heard it before but I just felt like adding my own touch and also combine all the previous points let's talk about it and let's see my point of view on this first of all referring to my old video which is the 10 signs she's not your true friend or the 10 signs that makes a, tr a fake friend go to it uh, and I'm gonna put it here somewhere on the screen, whatever, here or here, it doesn't matter. Um, click on it. This is really annoys me. When I have a best friend, and I know she's my best friend, or maybe she's claiming to be my best friend, and she never likes my statuses whatsoever, even if she thinks that it's funny she doesn't like it and she'll go like other people and go comment on other people or compliment other people she doesn't want to compliment me why because obviously she's a fake friend that's on Facebook okay things that other uh, other things that people do on Facebook that annoys me number 11 so it's the 11 frustrating things that people do. Everyone on your list will know your activity. For example, if you like someone that is not in their list of friends, they're going to still see it. Why? Because everyone can track your activity. Who did you like? What page did you like? What f photo did you like? What photo did you comment on? What Okay, this is just an infinite loop and it's annoying because everyone will know what you like and what you dislike and what you comment on, who's your... F everything about you, people will know it. So, sometimes it's annoying because you don't want other people to know that you commented on that specific person or you like that specific photo or you like that specific celebrity. You don't want people to know, but Facebook can know everything, obviously and the people in your list. Number, number 10. When you get tagged on a photo or let's say a post or anything, you will have to receive all the notifications that people will comment on this specific post or this specific photo that you've been tagged on. Why do I have to read all the comments and why do I have to receive them? This is so annoying, Facebook. Tags can be annoying. Okay, I love tags, but tags can be annoying. Number nine. Getting pixel messages on your mail or on Facebook. Okay, Pixel is just an application on Facebook that you're going to be able to see all the top 10 pictures of the day, the, the top, the, whatever, what's wrong with me, the top, uh, the top of the day, the top of the week, the top of the month, you're going to be able to, um, you're going to see all the pictures in this Pixable, but you're going to see this uh, messages from Pixable like every day or every week, and sometimes you don't want to receive them because for once you're going to think oh I ha I've got mail I've got a new message I've got a new comment and then it's fixable you know what it is like end of the 
of the day, you're going to receive a bunch of fixable messages on your mailbox, which is annoying. Number eight, annoying thing. Meaningless statuses on Facebook that people post. Meaningless statuses on Facebook, such as what? Good morning. How are you? Hello, everybody. Good night. I want to sleep. I'm bored. Okay, when you say I'm bored, okay, I've said it once on Facebook and I kind of regret it. Yes, I regretted it because when I said it, people were programmed to offer me a solution like, she's bored. What can we, what can we tell her? Swim? Dance? She's bored. It's kind of a challenge to tell people that you're bored and they have to offer you a solution. I don't know, it doesn't make sense to me. Number seven annoying thing, and you all know it, or some of you do it. <laughs> Complaining on Facebook. Please don't complain on Facebook. Facebook is not a psychiatric office. You don't have to say, I'm depressed. I am annoyed. Everything is just so against me. I hate people. People hate me. Don't complain. People will, don't want to hear your complaints, especially on these websites. Obviously, you are using Facebook wrong. Or maybe you are just a sp apathetic person that you want to talk to a wall. Number six, annoying thing. Creepy messages from guys. Okay, you are a stranger. Why do I have to respond to you? Especially, I've got a message like long time ago and maybe because of my profile picture. Usually, I like to put profile pictures that are so... Not quite tempting, but you know, good looking or gorgeous. And they always say to me, Hello, you're so pretty. Can we, kn can we get to know each other? No, we can't get to know each other because you're just so a creepy weirdo. Number five, annoying. People who write long posts. Okay, maybe you are a blogger and you like to post articles, but Facebook is not for articles. You can't just put a long essay on a status update. Come on. Okay, I've seen paragraphs. I've seen some few lines, but an essay, an article, and then people will have to press the continue reading thing. Believe me, 98% of the people who will go on your news feed will not press continue reading. So it's just a waste because you're, they're not going to read it. And why do I have to post it anyway? Go to some other websites like Blogger or WordPress or whatever and post whatever article you want to post. Number three annoying thing. Getting invites from Facebook to games. Okay, I'm not a gamer, so please don't send me these requests. Maybe if I enjoy playing, maybe. But I, I already mentioned in my status updates that, hey people, I don't usually respond to these kind of requests and I will ignore them, so please don't send me any. Facebook game requests and keep on s receiving them so it's kind of annoying so you need to get it not everyone likes to play so you don't have to invite people to just random stuff just for the sake of inviting okay I'm not I'm not I'm, I'm not trying to be rude and um, it's not about me actually everyone sometimes gets annoyed from this because it's annoying from time to time even even if I enjoy playing games I don't want you to pick me the game that I want to play that's my point of hate to receive these useless invites number two annoying thing on Facebook is getting tagged in some pictures that you are not in them and your photos will look like this and most likely 
pictures that you don't care about. Number one, and the most important one annoying thing on Facebook. Getting random West from from random people on Facebook. Okay, you're just a random person. Why do I have to add you on my list? I'm not trying to collect people from all over the world. Okay, Facebook is not like Twitter. Okay, I understand that sometimes you can make anyone follow you on Twitter, because maybe, but Facebook is only for friends and families and maybe some acquaintances, but not everyone. I'm not going to add everyone, obviously, so... I don't Actually, getting random requests is like people wearing a mask. Hello. Um, obviously it's a stranger. Can you make, can you add me as a friend? No, I cannot add you as a friend because you are just random. Okay. That's my 11 annoying things people do on Facebook and I really hope you enjoy it. Watching this because I enjoy doing it and I really want to get this out of my chest really and I love you guys for whoever is watching and please subscribe please subscribe over there and let me know in the comments if you really like this video and give it a thumbs up if you really like it and uh, let me know what color do you want to do you want me to wear for my next video because I'm gonna wear all the colors you can imagine and uh, and thank you bye bye.